Hello, my name is Tom DeHaas, co-founder of Interface Fluidics. I'm coming to you from our lab at the National Institute for Nanotechnology in beautiful Edmonton, Alberta. Welcome to the second video in our Visual Reservoir series. Since our last video, we've refilled our microfluidic chip with fresh oil. This video will demonstrate water flooding. Water flooding is considered a secondary recovery method and is typically employed after primary production. Primary production is where oil is driven from the rock through natural forces including solution drive and the expansion of the rock and fluid. Primary production will be a topic of a future video. Water has a low viscosity compared to the oil, but is readily available, which is why it's commonly injected. You will see the same vis viscous fingering behavior that you saw in our first video, but since water is much more viscous than air, more oil will be displaced. What you see on the screen is one of our polymer microfluidic devices that has been patterned to resemble a porous sandstone reservoir. The distance from the top to the bottom of the video is 6 inches. In our next video, we'll take a look at enhanced oil recovery method called polymer flooding. The initial condition of our next video will be what you see at the end of this video.